Let's do some quick cag bag questions and we can go to bed. Oh, it's late already. It is. It's At Night's Eternal writes in and asks, has Wombat reconsidered how crazy it is to eat and bowl without running to the restroom to wash up at the same time? Uh, a, it's fairly normal for like 90%. I laugh I, I laughed when I read the question. You don't have to answer <laughs> yes, the question. It, it, two, it's a funny question. Yes. And three, I would love the opportunity to go bowling and eating again. <laughs> right, and get Because diarrhea. we're trapped in hell. Right. So... Right. I just is uh, yeah. that your first stop once we get out of this? <laughs> no, my kids don't really like bowling. They yeah. don't like it. They also don't like anything. But uh, Flash. If they had Flash at the bowling alley. If they had Flash at the bowling alley, I know. All right. Uh, I just laughed. It was a good oh question. My God, if if Grant nice. Gustin was at the bowling alley, my daughter would be there. She she would run. To she the loves alley. Grant Gustin. She does. Yeah. Who doesn't? Yeah, exactly. He's very slender. He's a handsome man. And he's slender. Mm-hmm. He's, he cuts a slender, sh- uh, slender what? What's the word I'm looking for? I don't know, but uh, you're going somewhere. Jibe? Jib? Jib? Mm-hmm. Isn't that the sail on the, the front that is, sail? That is part the of the sailboat, sailboat. yeah. Mm-hmm. At Dan Hacker writes in and asks, is Shipwreck getting the new G.I. Joe classified figures that are hitting right now? How can you get them if they're classified? Womp womp. <laughs> So you have to know somebody. I I I don't know. That I might uh, pick. How up much? A snake. They're twenty dollars. These oh, are that's right. these are the equivalent of Marvel Legends. Yeah, Marvel Legends or the DC figures that nobody buys. Um, right. I I feel like they're probably going to drop in price because not a lot of GI Joe people looking for figures currently. Do they have or, Destro? Or like weird, they do have you know, yeah, but they're not G.I. Joe figures, you know? They're they're too nice. Oh, it looks good. Yeah, G.I. Joe figures are shitty. I, I would rather have a good one. I I would probably get a Snake Eyes just for Dash, because it's the same size. He has a whole bunch of Power Rangers figures that were $5 on clearance at GameStop at one point. They're that same style, like it's that $20 figure. Okay, um, Destro looks awesome. It comes with a Cobra na- uh, suitcase and a like a sniper pistol. Does it come with a and Mar- a gold gun? A Mars too. suitcase or a Cobra suitcase? This is important. Uh, Cobra. Mm. Okay. Why? What did you say? What Mars? Mars. Who? That's Destro's didn't, company. Didn't you see the movie? No, I watched <laughs> the cartoon. Didn't Isn't this from the cartoon? Didn't you see the movie? No. I watch the TV show like a normal person. I Do they I actually like sell these... them on Amazon. Are they are they GameStop. available? GameStop has them. Yeah, they, no, I, they're I the, like... so does Am- Oh, it's this will be released on June first. Yeah, I I like a f- couple of the looks of the figures. Some of them, I'm not a big fan of the roadblock that they made. Yeah, I don't like I don't like the that version of roadblock. Yeah, um, let me see. When you put them all together in a group, they look cool. But I'm not going to buy. One hundred and twenty dollars worth of figures, or whatever it would be. Yes, you are. No. I'm gonna. Snake they, Eyes is already sold out on Amazon. They're not accepting anymore. Sure, orders. there's two versions of Snake Eyes as well. Oh, as, there is as always. There's like a chase variant of him as well. What's um, the chase? What's the difference? Uh, I think he has some red red accents, and he's slightly different. I don't know. This one has red accents that I'm looking at. Is this the Chase one then? Maybe, maybe? that that might be the one that sold out then. Shipwreck knows an awful lot of athletes for somebody who's not interested in buying them. It's not that hard to keep up on G.I. Joe news. <laughs> it's not that much. I I I'm, I'm, I'm not surprised. Feet. Why would I be surprised that, that Shipwreck knows what's going on? With I'd be more surprised if he didn't. You, you no, know but what I'm... I am getting? It's the Funko Pop of Shipwreck that's coming out. Oh, they're okay. Ma- they're making a Shipwreck Funko Pop. I oh. mean, that, that also makes sense. Yeah. Can I Google that? Mm-hmm. They're also making uh, nano figures. I'm going to get those as well. The little metal cheap figures. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah they're, they're making those, which that those are cool to because they're the 80s style um, uh, characters. Cool. Yeah. You're saying you, you don't want a uh, Marvel Legends series rock python figure? Because that's only nine dollars and eighty seven cents on on Amazon right now. I don't know what a what is what's a rock python. Uh, he was a lame super super villain from the comic books. Who I believe part of the Serpent Society fought Captain America. He has a really ugly blue costume. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Does he come with like somebody's leg? 
Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> you know it. I have like so we've gotten some of those figures too because like they go on clearance for five dollars and like, it's mm-hmm. like oh yeah I'll take this five dollar Ant Man. But yeah. then we then we get we're like stuck with like leftover like monster legs and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like what is yeah. this? One of the best ones we ever found was a was a, a Batman build a figure series. This was years ago at this point, but they had all of them. So we actually got to build the build a figure. <laughs> It was a very exciting day. Yeah, we we did the same thing with those Power Rangers figures. Like we bought them all because they were five dollars each, and you, they all made a Megazord figure. And then as I'm assembling it, I snap off one of the pieces. Oh no! Right. So now he's got super. He's got gorilla glue all along the back of him, and his leg doesn't bend. <laughs> Sounds about right. Yeah, I was like, oh, I could pay twenty dollars and get him another torso, so I could connect all these legs and arms again, but. I think I think this gorilla glue will do just fine. <laughs> do you want to see what my DJ system looks like? Look. Oh, you have it in hand. Yep. It's oh, am- it's very, like it's very retro looking. I realize you're doing you're doing something visual now for the show. Let's get back to the keg bag. It's very small and light, and you don't even need to plug it into anything. It just runs off of USB power off a laptop. It's cool. crazy. Uh, Shanna fan wrote it. Oh, we answered this question about Shipwreck's Attic uh, TV system. At Slick Rate wants to know, what's the worst video game hot take you've heard recently or of all time? Just this week, I saw a top-rated video game podcaster put out his list of the 100 greatest games of all time, and his number one greatest game was Breath of the Wild. Who was it? I forgot. But it was someone on my list, and I'm like... It's fine, but really, number one, num- num- best game, two out of three people on this show are not fans of that game. Well, so. that's his best game. Yeah. That's- no, I think he said, no, he did like a like a whole thing, like calculation show, and I'm like, I don't know. I don't <laughs> Wait, think did so. calculations on his best game? I think so. I would say like the that was the, the most recent thing. Anyone who says that's the best game of all time, like it's fine. And if you like it, I'm glad you like it. But stop. Right. I would say I have a Nintendo related one. People I'll, I'll often think that Nintendo is different than the other video game companies. They care more about the customer or they don't care about making money as much as Sony or Microsoft. I'd say that's 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 a generally bad hot take that pops up often. Shipwreck, do you have one? I don't. I don't know. I see them all the time, but then I just, I just ignore them. So I don't commit any like memory to any of the bad hot takes. Right. Um, That's fine. Yeah, I, I'm just firmly in the summer of Game Fest. Um, <laughs> summer of Jeff Keeley. Yeah. Th- was there any summer this week? No. No, there was, I thought. Riot. Wasn't there uh, Riot Games announced today? Something about oh, okay. the uh, v- Valorant, or however you say it. Valorant? Does anybody know how to pronounce that? Valorant? Like the new hot thing. Yeah. Should, we should know that. Valorant. 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 Maybe? I don't it's know. It's coming out June so. 2nd, I think, they said. That's nice. Wombat, if you could master this game... I could see you really blowing up on Twitch. I would have to. Would I would, I'm not. I'm not. I don't have the money for a PC that could play it. Let's see. Listen. I'm, I'm just saying. I don't. I don't know what to say. What do you mean? I think that's that. It'll run on anything, probably. No. It's designed. It's a. It's not a. It's not a graphics uh, powerhouse. Not, that game. It's not playing on this. What? No, what do you got playing, over there? Not, I've got a freaking Dell Latitude. That's what I got. I said. What is, or Inspiron. Inspiron? Yeah, yours is better. Yours is a lot better. Well, I just got me. it. It's, yeah, yeah, it's really good. From the 30 minutes yeah. that I use it, it yeah. seems really good. Um, What else? Oh, we talked about interest, being interested in my Minecraft dungeons. Fendoza wrote in and wanted to know if uh, we're interested. It's like, is that that's up to four players too, right? Locally, you think? All right, I see Wombat's just scrolling on the internet now. So, sounds reasonable. <laughs> Okay. I can see in Wombat's glasses that he's. Uh, I know looking it's at least two player co op. Yeah. Minecraft. Yeah. Yeah, I'm. We're excited. Ty's really excited. He just like came up to me today, actually, and just turned around and said, "Minecraft's coming next week." 